No, can I? You want to give him a tour of the trike? Okay, let's make it go like this. Can you move a little bit? Mm -hmm. Okay. What's that up there? A bell. Uh huh. A bill? A bell. <laughs> oh, a bell. Okay. All right. Oh, whoa, you hit the button there, didn't you? <laughs> Maybe let's keep it turned off, huh? Yeah. Yeah, good idea. Wow. Okay. Uh, riding it babies. Riding it babies? Mm -hmm. What kind of paint is on here? Red paint. Uh-huh. It was plastic paint last time, but it chipped off. And this was powder coated on. So, we got powder coat red, which is super nice. We've got the, uh, yeah, we've got the motor in the front, the controller, and everything's wired up nice. And then we've got, we've got a big hunk of lead acid in the back. This is uh, three 12 volt, 18 amp hour cells wired in series. And it's like way too heavy for this trike, but we're making it work right now until we get some lithium on this sucker. Yeah. So this project has been really fun for uh, my dad and I to collaborate on and uh, He's gotten a lot out of the trike. Uh, he's getting up in age, he's like 88 now, so it gives him a lot more mobility and freedom to get around town and stuff like that. So if uh, anyone wants to do a project like this, I would encourage you to go ahead and do the research online and look into stuff and find an old trike and fix it up, put a kit on it. And, uh, go to town, literally. My dad goes to uh, the store and back all the time and goes around and uh, he gets a lot of use. That's why we call it the daily driver. So, Anyway, cheers. Have fun. Come on, thing. Go. Isn't that something?